Keeping kids healthy and sending the men and women fighting for our country a sweet treat. A Valley dentist is doing just that with an offer some parents may find too good to refuse. 8 News Now is live. Jonathan Martinez joins us now with the sweet details. Jonathan. Denise, over the irony of it, this is a candy buyback drive. In fact, uh, just one example here, a drop off more than 50 pounds of candy right here just by one individual and people still lined up to give. Joining me now to talk a little bit more about it is the doctor in charge of all of this, dentist Kent Wagner. Pretty much let us know, explain to us what's taking place here and who all this benefits, if you don't mind. Well, as you can see, we have all this candy and this candy is going to do any good for any of the kids um, as far as oral health goes. So what we want to do this year was buy back some of that candy for the kids. We'll give them a dollar a pound uh, and a raffle ticket for an iPod shuffle. And then all the candy we're going to take and bunch up, we'll send it off to the troops in Afghanistan, Iraq, through Operation Gratitude, which is a great charitable organization. As we understand, this is actually wrapping up in just the next hour and a half or so, but what's the turnout been like thus far for you? The turnout so far has been incredible. We've been really impressed with uh, the people wanting to come in and donate uh, all this candy. So far, we've had over 250 pounds of candy donated, so we're pretty excited. How much were y'all expecting? Is this something that y'all thought the turnout would be like? We didn't think it would be this much. Uh, we were hoping for maybe 200 pounds or so if we were lucky, um, but we've been really excited about how much we've had. It's been great. Now, certainly a unique way to keep kids healthy along with supporting our troops. So why do you feel this was so important to take part in? Uh, we were looking for a good way to help out the kids, you know, avoid cavities. That's our job, obviously, as dentists. Um, Halloween's a scary time for the kids with ghosts and goblins and everything like that going on. Um, but we wanted to go ahead and make it scary, you know, have, make it fun for the kids at the same time and let them buy back that candy and get that's why candy off the streets and avoid the cavities. So a buck for every pound, huh? A buck for every pound, yeah. All right, Dr. Wagner, I appreciate it very, very much. Again, the drive will be wrapping up in less than an hour and a half at 6 o'clock. We are actually in the 2000 block of Village Circle, so still a little bit of time for you to make it out here, and what better way to get rid of some of that extra candy. As we understand, there is another similar drive taking place in another part of the city. If you'd like more information, you can log on to our website at lasvegasnow.com, and the keyword there is candy. For now, I think I'm going to go enjoy a little bit of this candy that has been given up here. <laughs> Reporting live, I'm Jonathan Martinez. Eight news now. <laughs> yeah, there's a lot of there. Probably a couple hundred pounds in the news, or we either have to eat or give away. I like the dentist shirt. Got candy. Yeah, I like very it too. It's very nice. <laughs> well, honoring his.